Nintendo's lesser known gaming franchise. It spawned two games in its short life, both on the Nintendo Entertainment System, or NES as many know it better as. The original came out in 1990, while its lone sequel, Zoda's Revenge Star Tropics 2, came out in 1994. I want to bring these games to light, as many have forgotten the franchise over time. That, and I still find myself playing it today. Why is it important to me developing this site? I developed this site, this website, because I wanted to give people a look at a game franchise I very much grew up with and loved as a child. And show others, Nintendo isn't just Mario, Zelda, or Pokemon. Brief Overview of Requirements Documents This website gives brief descriptions of the franchise, its games, the characters, including the heroes, the villains, the allies, as well as the weapons and tools the player will use in each game, as well as allow people to even take a poll about their levels of gaming knowledge. Short Demonstration of the Site Here on the home page, we see all the links, a nice big logo, as well as a banner showcasing the main hero, Mike's tra trademark weapon, a yo-yo. Yes, a yo-yo. In its many forms. And here's the code for the page. Next is the timeline page, which allows you to see links to both games and the franchise, as well as an image that, when rolled over with the mouse, shows the same boss fight as it appears in both Star Tropics and Zoda's Revenge Star Tropics 2. Snake boss, both times, but different eras of when the game was created, the games were created. How well did the code meet the original requirements? The coding for the website met what I believe to be most of the requirements, as it gives pretty much everything that was needed. If anything, the only major changes that needed to be done was sadly remove the image background that I had, as I could not get a font color to go well in the end with the image, and so it was changed to a single color background. In terms of what went well for the project, well, I actually got to revisit a game I loved to play back as a kid, and while it may not hold up to today's video game standards, or anything of that sort, it is still a fun game if you give it a chance. In terms of challenge, really the biggest issue was finding material about the games. There isn't a ton of images or even music on this game outside of the few YouTube channels with people having similar fondness to the games as I did. If I did anything differently, I might have tried to add my own gameplay footage, but due to certain technical issues that proved impossible at this time, wasn't possible. Still, if I had gotten some people interested in the maybe checking out Star Tropics and its sequel, Zoda's Revenge Star Tropics 2, whether through Nintendo's virtual console, the original NES cart, or <coughs> emulation, that would be great for me, because this is a franchise that needs to be remembered, I say, and it would be great if Nintendo would bring it back someday. Hint, hint, 